Welcome to my presentation on how to create a personalized homepage using Google Homepage. When you get to the classic page of Google, you need to go to the interactive Google or iGoogle up here. There's already a pre-prepared homepage started for you, but if you want to truly personalize it, you'll need you'll need to create a Google account. You can click sign in. And if you haven't got it, a Google account already, then you can click this button here. To create your account, you need to fill in your email address here, your password, repeat your password, copy the letters for the verification code, and finally, click the button to accept and create your account. Once you have your account, you will need to sign in to reach your personalized page. If you click here, then you can sign in in this box here. Fill in your email, and if you've got your computer to remember your password, it'll appear automatically. Then click the sign in button. and your page will appear. Adding and deleting gadgets from your home page is very simple. To add gadgets, you click the Add Stuff button, which will take you to the home page content, which is a list of different gadgets that you may choose to add to your, your home page. The one I'm looking for is the Enhanced Links, which is very useful because it can group together web links under a topic. I click Search, and I find it. By clicking here, I can find out more about it, but I know I'm going to just add it now. This dialog box tells me that it's not made by Google, and I may not trust it, but I've used it before, so I'll click Yes. If I go back to my home page, in the top left hand corner it has appeared. By clicking the arrow button I can edit this, the settings and give it a title. I'm going to put fun links here. Save it. Click OK to confirm it. Now if I wish to add a link by clicking the add bookmark I can type in a name or a description and then copy and paste the web address here and click Add. Deleting gadgets is even simpler. By clicking this button here, I can see that it's been deleted. I can close this box and it's gone. Google Home tab page, as other home pages, are organized by tabs. Each tab contains a new page of your home page. There is a button which says Add a tab, and by simply clicking it, a new tab will appear. However, Google will only allow six tabs that way. But if you would like to add another tab, it's not a hard thing to do. In the address bar at the top of your page, paste in this number. Click Go and a new tab appears. Here you can write the name of your new tab to add. If you don't want the tab, click Delete. Thank you for listening to my presentation.